Yo, what's good, yeah? It's your boy Weezy back again with another video for you. So, in today's video, I'm gonna give you an update on a USD chip, right? So, we we, we are holding this trade uh, since last week, so it's been five days since we took this entry point. Uh, and we took this entry point, the market was here, right? The market was here, and now the market is here. So, um, I'm gonna show you the reason why we took this entry point. And uh, what are we expecting the next right so if you've been watching videos so you already know because i this is signal here i share this analysis on uh on a youtube as well and uh, yeah so let me show you the reason why we took this entry point right so as you can see we are on uh it's a usd chief and we are on a four four hour time frame right and um uh, and the reason of us selling this market it was uh, a break of the trend line and a retaste of it right and uh this is strategy it's a trend line strategy right so um as you can see here we had we had a beautiful uptrend right we had a beautiful uptrend the market was respecting this trend line like all the time the market was respecting this trend line but when it comes here as you can see the market came and it break this trend line right so as a forex trader when the when the market when the price break the trend line and if you're using trend line strategy when the market to break the trend line immediately you are going to wait for the test of the market so the market is is gonna go and retest this trend line the broken trend line and then it's gonna keep going down right it's gonna go to the to the point where the market started which is this one here right and that's the reason why we took this entry point so this entry point we took it was um a break of trend line so we waited for a retest and once the market went up to the test, then we took our entry point, right? And this is a USD chief, and this is the update, guys, right? So I hope everyone is inside is is is, is selling this one. So we took the entry point over here, as you can see. This was our entry point right here, right? And the reason why I took because the market came and the market started going up, right? And as you can see here, we had a a zone right and we had a trend line so the market uh was going to retest this zone and uh and a, and a trend line as well right so once the market went up and uh, reached this zone immediately i took my sell position because you never know the market could retest only zone or trend line strategy but the stop loss we put all the way inside this trend line right because um once the market break the trend line and it went up to retrace the market can't break again trend line two times like going up so you need to put your stop loss inside the trend line that's a safe place so if the market go up and a break and it hit the stop loss that simply mean that market is not uh is not a, a sell right so just make sure that you put your 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 stop loss at the safe at the safe place oh you understand so that's it guys um this signal here was shared in on youtube and and in the vip group as well so um so as you can see right and what are we expecting next right and what i'm gonna tell you is uh i always say this don't ever let a, a winning trade become a loser again right because you can see here we already have like more than 90 pips already grab um something like 90 pips like and when you you already grab 90 pips <coughs> just make sure that you close uh some of your some of the profit you understand and how do you close it because the trade we took based on one hour time frame so you can't close on one hour time frame you have to switch at least on one hour and then you are going to find a safe place to close this market and where is the safe place here to close as you can see the safe place to close the market is where the market give you a, a a opportunity like you see the market how it was going like this right so we have places that you can close you can close the profit here or here so all those are safe place to close the market though the profit you understand but for me um i'm gonna i'm gonna close it i'm gonna i'm gonna uh trail it i'm gonna i'm gonna close the the some of the profits here 
so i'm gonna take my stop loss as you can see the stop loss is here i'm gonna shift this stop loss and I put it to right here above at let me show you the price let me show you the price As you can see, it's at 0 0.92086, right? So that's where I'm gonna put, going to put my, I'm gonna shift to my stop loss, right? So, yeah, so let's go back on for our time frame, right? So what we are expecting here, guys, is the next week the market will drop all the way down, right? So as you can see, we're here right now. So the market will come all the way down to this take profit right that's what we are expecting but make sure that you lock the profit once you're in a profit lock the profit and the more the thing i mean the amazing thing is as you can see our stop loss was too small right the stop loss was how many pips the stop loss was 53 pips right and how many pips are we chasing 226 right which is not bad though all right understand 226 pips right and the stop loss was just like 50 51 pips so she's not bad um yo guys this is what i have for you today this is your sd chief right so the thing is don't close don't close let's keep holding but make sure that you lock the profit as i said don't ever let the winning trade become a loser and as you can see the market is heading down so next week we're gonna have a a strong sell on a usd chief right so i'm gonna check if i'm gonna get an opportunity like for day traders for day traders like if i get an opportunity i'm gonna send in a vip in a vip group and tell you how to sell this market because we're gonna have a big a big sell next week on a usd chief so if you're holding don't don't close your trade you just keep holding keep holding keep holding right so that's it guys and uh another thing is if you want to be in a vip group um i will leave the link down below i will leave the link down below of a public telegram group so you are going to join a public group then you are you're gonna contact me when you're in inside if you want to join a vip group right and another thing is um you can also send me a message on whatsapp i leave my link my whatsapp number down below so you can just simply contact me and then i will send you the plan then you're ready to go right so this is the usd chief guys this is the usd chief i just want to give you an update guys the reason of our selling it was a break out a break of trend line right let me repeat it again as you can see we had a beautiful uptrend that was a beautiful uptrend and uh when the market came here so i knew it when the market came here it was it came with the high uh momentum so the market came and i knew okay it's gonna break so after the breakout i waited for a retest right and then after the market went up to retest that's when we sold this market and now we are holding to this point here right so that's the reason why we took this entry point based on trend line strategy and the market has break the up trend and we waited for a retest of it then we sold it and we're still holding right I know we've been holding for days guys so it's just as i always say being patient in the market pays off so you need to be sure of what you're doing you understand be sure of what you're doing trust the process once you get an entry point up in your position put your stop loss and yeah and leave the market do its job i always say this like when you open a position leave the market do its job so as you can see right now, um, yeah, you as the chief who was holding for five days, and now this is this is the result, right? And we still keep go going, right? Because I'm gonna we're gonna wait till here. You understand? That will be our take profit, right? That's our our first take profit. But what I see here is the market will keep going down more than that because if you switch on daily time frame you can see that the nature of this market it's a downtrend so if you do this 
right it's a downtrend so we might have we might hit the second take profit which is this one here so the market might come and break this one retest and keep going you understand so if you are able to hold it like for months hey you can hold it you can hold it it's all depend on you and your your account like the account that you have because you also need to trade every day so if you have a small account i will advise you when the market hit this target here get out even now if you have a small account get out because broker will charge you like the commissions so when the market sleep during weekends so yo guys that's it that's it let's go back on what for our time frame and this is the video guys so yeah another thing guys you know um i'm dropping a lot of videos on this youtube like showing you how to trade so if you are new on this youtube make sure that you hit the subscribe button ring the bell icon down below so don't forget to like the video man it will mean a lot to me so ciao guys i hope to see you again on the next video